The gray outboard fuel line, often associated with EPA-compliant fuel hoses, has become notorious in marine circles for causing fuel issues, particularly in boats built or rigged since the mid-2000s. Here's everything you need to know about the gray fuel line. What is the gray outboard fuel line? Material, typically made of a gray-colored thermoplastic, often with an inner liner of polyamide or fluoropolymer. EPA mandate, introduced after the EPA 2011 regulations requiring low permeation fuel hoses that reduce hydrocarbon emissions. Common brand, many gray hoses are Atwood EPA compliant lines, but others exist. Common issues. One, inner liner deterioration. The inner lining of the hose, often a nylon layer, can delaminate. This causes pieces of liner to flake off, restricting fuel flow or clogging filters, carbs, and injectors. 2. Ethanol breakdown. Ethanol blended fuel, E10 or E15, accelerates breakdown of the inner layer. The chemical reaction can soften or swell the liner, releasing debris into the system. 3. Fuel starvation symptoms. Engine bogs down under throttle hard starting or rough idle. Fuel primer bulb won't stay firm or collapses during running. Identification. Color. Gray exterior, sometimes with printed labeling. EPA compliant fuel line or low permeation. Texture. Softer than older black hoses tends to kink or soften in heat. Markings, often printed with SAE J1527 type B1-15 EPA certified and date codes. How to test if it's failing one. Cut the hose open. Inspect the inside for peeling or blistering of the liner. 2. Check the primer bulb. If it's integrated, debris may also clog the check valves. 3. Fuel filter check. Look for black or brown flakes trapped inside. What to do if you have one replace it? Best solution is to replace with a high quality black ethanol rated hose. Use SAE J1527 Type A 1-15 for inboard, B1-15 for outboard applications. Brands, Shields, Sierra, Trident, Mercury, OEM, avoid gray aftermarket hoses, flush the system, replace or clean fuel filters, water separators, and carb injectors. Inspect primer bulb and all fittings for signs of degradation, avoid reinstalling gray hose, even new gray hoses may eventually fail the same way. Preventative tips. Use non-ethanol fuel if available. Add fuel stabilizer if using E10. Replace gray fuel lines every two to three years or sooner if issues arise. Avoid sharp bends and protect hoses from UV and heat. Final takeaway. The gray fuel line is a weak point in many fuel systems due to internal liner breakdown, particularly when exposed to ethanol. If you're experiencing fuel starvation, rough running, or strange debris and filters, the gray hose is a prime suspect. Replacing it with ethanol safe black hose and cleaning the system is the best solution. Thank you for watching this brief video. Please click on the like button, subscribe to my channel, and feel free to leave a comment. I usually respond to comments in 24 to 48 hours. Have a great day today and every day.